It depends on. I mean, I, it depends on what he's doing. I mean, I wouldn't stand uh -oh. behind him okay. if, if, I didn't, if, I didn't, if I didn't. If I didn't back the policy, I wouldn't stand behind it. T -T. You know, so it's not going to be because he's a black president. If I didn't back what he's supporting, then I wouldn't stand behind it. TT, we brought out that the health care bill, eight hundred and seventy-one billion, uh -huh. basically guaranteed that the, the people who made that eight hundred and seventy-one billion were the same insurance companies that you've been struggling against all the time, and that by writing this. And not having a, uh, a, a a government plan, having a separate plan, an independent plan, that when you were guaranteeing that 871 million billion, you were specifically guaranteed to the specific industry folks. Now they're really looking at all that money, and I had even suggested that maybe we go three or four years down the line and just default. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong. With you that know, let just say, wait, no, try to see that. Say, what if we go? We thought about it in 871, no, nah, we can't do that, 220, 220, there you go. 220, <laughs> 220, right. and we'll call, and checks in the mail. That's it. Because I'm thinking, I just told everybody, you have to learn to play these people's rules too, but I said, oh. the plot thickens. Remember I told you, TT, see, that's like, I'm like you, TT, see, I go like, but the money, y'all, the money, I go, 871, okay, but they just guaranteed the money too. Oh no, it might not work out. It might not. But check your benefits. Right. Check your, check, check your, <laughs> no, make sure you got some benefits. Because yes. people were saying, oh yeah, they can charge you whatever they want. Okay, all right. All right, well, we want to. They're already doing it. As soon as, Danny, they, as soon as they already knew it was going to pass. Okay. That's why they right. went up 36%. Right. I believe it was Blue Cross was the first one to sell us all out, mm. which they were going to do anyway, you guys. I mean, come on. Look, there's going to be some backlash from you the know peanuts, what? the. the, the okay. The, the hillbillies, the wranglers, deliverance, whatever you want to call them. What about the, the black bags, folks, though? Gonna... Wait, wait, that's because that's the thing. Because are we back to that? Are you an Uncle Tom if you question the president? No, I don't. I mean, I don't. Because you know, I remember that, see, that? My whole thing with the Uncle Tom term, I used oh, to even say back that. then, you better be really careful right. who you call some things, okay, right. to me. Because you don't know, everybody fights the revolution. But see, you have to understand what's happening out there. There's some very interesting lines being drawn. And as the resident leftists are around here, I don't like nobody telling me yep. what to think, where to sit. That mm -hmm. was the problem with a whole bunch of stuff. Yep. I like you tell me what to wear, where to sit, who else I can hang out with. I'm a non-conformant. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I'm what you call a non-conformant. <laughs> I can't do right no, now. No, I can't wear no special outfits. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. <laughs> I can't do it. I got to do me. I got to do it the way I want to do it. That's why I'm single. I don't want to take out the trash. Sometimes I want to come in the house, leave my drawers right where they at. That's what I want to do. That's a problem. What the problem? That's you a problem. Because my fresh drawers, that's I want to leave my fresh a drawers. That's problem. Nothing wrong with my with fresh drawers. For sanitary drawers. reasons, that's a problem. Okay, but what about well, y'all you know with the on the shower thing? With what the clean. The they're not in front of you. Now when they, your guests come over, you got to step over and, you know, oh my you got some, like, there. alligator that's trying to hold on to well, your leg. Now that I see we have a real more okay. reasonable balance here today, I got to ask Miss TT. Uh, toilet seat up okay with you? No. <laughs> no. no, you can't. You, no. Uh, you got an old fashioned no. in that. No, put it down. How, you tip? Put you tip? Down. How you tip? You tip? Yeah. Good? Yeah, the service you know, is good. I single, single black women, you know, they notorious. You know that. She said, oh, Mario okay. starts some stuff. I mean, she said, this man starts some stuff. No, they say that the sisters don't tip. That's what even the no, sisters. got class. I, get, I, get I can tell. Class. I'm trying to say Chicago Oprah. <laughs> 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 say Oprah. <laughs> I told you about Mario. All right. <laughs> you know, okay, so, all right. So, okay, so, all right. So, that was the whole thing I wanted to raise because it's st more stuff coming, you guys. We're going to keep coming back to this because I, have, I just don't have enough to tell you yet because I need to really go back. And, and formulate a really opinion. I don't know, TT, if you know, have an opinion, but so, uh, Daddy, do you know somehow there was a thing with Tom Joyner really critical of Tavis Smiley. They accused Tavis of, you know, back, you know, stabbing the president. Al Sharpton's insinuating out there. Al Sharpton's out there lobbying for the president. Church. <laughs> see, let's see. I mean, he's out there. He's out there saying, "Get behind the president." They had a meeting and came to some kind of agreement. And since then, Al is rounding up support in the ghetto for the president. But what did Tavis Smiley say? 
I didn't hear. You know, Tavis I'm just... I'm not clear on that. That's why Tavis, it's pissing me off. Tavis yeah. never says anything. Tavis has always said the same things. He says that that presidents, the president will be a great president if we push him to be a great president. Okay? Like all presidents, they need to be pushed into doing things, acts of service, things, because if not, if not... You don't really get. You need, in other words, you need to basically stay pushing the president and being demanding of the president, just like any other. You know president. what it is. You know what it was. It was. Um, what Tavis is said to have criticized the president for not pushing the black agenda. That's what it was. Tavis been hating on Barack since he was running. What is the black agenda? That's what I'm talking about. I agree with you. <laughs> and I don't think I don't think that's what Tavis said. You got to out there. We need some more more liquor. We need Coke Forty Fives everywhere. The black agenda. If you ain't got no Coke Forty Five and a picture of Tupac in your house. You ain't part of the blessing. <laughs> well, Next to Jesus. Well, T.T., that's why I, I said, well, too, I said, I'm so glad we kind of under the radar a little bit. Because I said, I've actually been more critical of the president than Tavis has been publicly. I mm -hmm. specifically said 7,000 drones over Afghanistan. You gave, I said, you finished, I said, Clinton finished all the financial plans that Bush started, and the president went right along with him. They gave all the money away. To the same people, all the banking money. I said in terms of the bailout, I said don't bail out the auto industry. I said bail out Let the people. Fail. I said bail. I said all those workers pay for them to have no taxes. Add this up and see if it comes out to still yep. cheaper. No taxes. Send them all back and train them. Mm -hmm. Get a new industry. Let it all fail. Yep. I was openly critical. I've been critical of the war in Afghanistan. I was critical financially. I said he basically is giving away all the money, continues to give it away to the same people that I have no respect for. I say he caved in on the gays. He hasn't done that. So I said, I, could, I said over in the radical leftist press, which is supposed to be feeling all this pressure to not criticize the president. And let me tell you, there's some brothers out there very critical. They have a little scoreboard up there going like, <laughs> there is the facts. Like I tell Danny, sooner or later there are the facts. Right now, in terms of the whole gay, you, the, you're not, these increased the war. You got more military presence in Afghanistan. Okay, the banking industry, you already done bailed out, okay, you got now record monies now. So and remember this whole credit economy, eight hundred and seventy one okay, billion dollars guaranteed to the same health care people that love you. You know, but that's okay, they go but this time with the money, now wait, wait, wait. With the money, they're going to take better care of you this time. They really are this time. They are. They are. They are, TT. Right. They are. <laughs> <laughs> it's going to be better. It'll be $871 billion better. Right. right. <laughs> better. So I've been, been actually vocal and critical of the president, but I said this, too. I said, we have to have at least a while to have just the joy of the black president. <laughs> Yeah, that's what. See, that's what I'm kind of on. I'm and the fact honest. that we're on the eight long, years of tyranny, Trey, Trey, but and bullshit, and the war that I didn't want, I'm I'm not, gotta pay but for you it, guys, I'm just saying. Oh, remember, yeah. this is what I'm we. You know what? See, you know what, you guys? I went through this stuff with Clinton before with my mother. Oh, they just love Bill. See, I was so tired of loving Bill. Oh, Bill, the first black president. <laughs> I love the clean. white women and he's oh, her. That's and, the black man. I don't care. Bill and so what? Dreads. The president got some hair. Bill had dreads in college. <laughs> <laughs> Bill had dreads. Played a trumpet. Oh, shades yeah. on. Man, come on. Bill was man. That was he man. redefined sex. Yeah. Now we know we get a little hair. That ain't no sex. Man, right. That's just three not. minutes of silence. Exactly. Be quiet. <laughs> you know, I think women are a lot more uh, easy to get along with with their mouthful. No. How's I tell you? Let's oh. <laughs> see. Okay, Chicago has no comment. Yeah. Oprah usually doesn't comment on those kind of things either. Though. I know. It's up. Okay, you guys.